Hey, so um, in this video, and this is a bit of an odd one now, and um, I'll just show you. So this is another part of this project, which is the Telecaster. Burnt timber smells lovely. Uh, so I haven't shown any of the designs, I've talked about them, but um, upon sanding back the top, and uh, yes, this is still the Telecaster body, as you can see. Um, upon sanding back, I'm not sure how well you see. Um, ooh, Jenny, um, I'll put it here, I'll fix the audio. Uh, upon sanding it back, so I don't scratch up the paint, uh, sand, you can see these lines. Originally, I got um, a 72 tin line picker for this body, and my original plan was to make it a dual humbucker teddy plan and then what actually happened was they got Kimmins so Kimmins went into it so the original plan of stripping this back and just having the natural top with burnt sides because I haven't got the money for the popular um, it's gone out of the window so now it's Pickard's time and um, also how I did this actually get I believe it was a was to get this which is a file on the multi-tool this is a work, work pro multi-tool that's broke uh, that's broken so it has a rasp edge to a file edge with two files on the side and I just it was filled with wood filler because originally that was the plan to chip it out but I got lazy got the Kimmins and the rest is history so I got the file kind of went like that along the whole thing and then filled them, super glued them in place and went on my way. So um, what's left to do is sand off the rest of the body. You can see the wood filler is the darker colour compared to the rest of it and yeah it's just oh, lemon oil. Um, yeah so I've made a few other adjustments that I'll have to do up as well in the picker design because there's a few other things I'm doing to it and they'll come in the future but until then I'm not saying it and I'll continue with the pickguard design and you might get it with the pickguard design because it's kind of a telly and kind of a 72 tin line but one of the features on it will look drastically misproportional until you actually see it when it's on the guitar itself so season a bit so everyone knows the Telecaster pickguard design and the box on the pickguard, so I'm not grabbing that. Um, I've got three boxes under my desk filled with guitar parts, ironically. Uh, but um, I wanted to do, since there was so much two picks in the guitar, uh, this is the size of the pickguard I'm working with, so it's halfway between a standard telly on this half and a 72 tin line on this, which I kind of like. Uh, but there's some bits that I had to fix, so here's the end result. If you can see that. And I like it. Um, yeah, I'm going to cut this out, put it up against the guitar and see how it looks from there. Um, so, yeah, see you in a minute. So, um, I have it on the guitar now. And let's see how this looks. There. Kind of looks, I think it looks really nice. And since it's a guitar for me and not for someone else. Uh, I'm happy enough with it. Uh, just need to cut out the shape for the neck pickup and yeah, get into continuing with it. So I might get the repair guy to do this or I might do it myself, uh, depending. Uh, so, well, anyway, it's definitely better than what I previously had for it, and it's definitely better than what it was, anyway, for sure. Because that blue paint is cracking like mad. Um, so, uh, next video, this was the pickguard design, and next video will probably be making the pickguard, and then in the same video I'll burn this. Um, I'll just give a quick overview of the work I've done today on this, just so you have an idea. So, I sanded back all the paint and realised that these lines here were wood filler. So I had to hollow them out and fill them. I ended up using bamboo toothpicks 
no reason for a specific word. It was just they were made out of bamboo. Uh, chiseled them flat and chiseled them as flat as I can and sanded them flush to the body. Um, realize that I might as well do it for the bridge screws holes. And you may be wondering, um, why is there four brown holes on this guitar? As you can see, and the reason is. I tried to make this a string, string true construction, I might have said this before, but I botched it. So the tailpiece that originally was on this at the time of doing the um, guitar kit videos, um, that uh, was a string through the bridge. So it's kind of the strings came up instead of through the body. So um, I need to re-drill them and fill them with dowel and glue them in place. And then the body can be burnt. And then the body will be oiled, waxed, and the pick art. I might get it made out of wood, I might get it made out of tortoiseloid. Either or, it will look nice on this guitar. So, um, I've been Ryan for Ryan's Guitar Stuff, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.